This is Stormy. Stormy likes our little Lahaina, even though they can roam the entire sanctuary. We've got some spots with hay nets strung up here and there to pick at. Sometimes you feel like grass, sometimes you feel like hay. Sometimes you feel like rubbing your head on the hay. <laughs> Stormy is uh, 25 or 26 this year. He was a racehorse. And then, as most of the racehorses that are saved, he went on to be a jumping horse. He actually went into, he actually did a little um, three day event thing. It's a little too close. Yes, I know. We're going to get a really big close up here. And, hi. Good boy. And we're a little dirty. <laughs> Horses have different different issues that will take them out of their careers. You know, most often, of course, it's it's injury, um, jumping, and in my opinion, from my experience with the horses that we take in and the injuries that they have. Uh, it's not real normal for a horse. Not to say that I didn't have, I haven't had friends in my life that did everything with their horses and were able to, sorry, it's gonna push, you know, keep their horses sound to their 30. But that isn't always the case. It isn't usually the case. And people don't even usually keep their own horse. Um, they say somewhere I read the average horse goes through at least seven or more homes and everyone does everything different everyone asks everything different everyone is a different rider in a different situation the different um, different saddles you know different methods and see here we have <laughs> I'm shedding he's just shedding him out and we're gonna get a brand new coat. It's gonna be bright and shiny. <laughs> See the shine on his neck? That's gonna go all through his body. You're gonna just come, I just, we're just gonna keep doing this down the road. Please, just stop, just stop for one minute and let me finish. Boy. So much for your personal space theories with horses. Hmm? It is not a disrespect with him. Horses don't have that part of the brain to disrespect you. Horses cannot respect you. They cannot disrespect you. Horses can only be horses. And it is our job as humans to figure out <laughs> horses. And you do that by spending time with horses. The more horses, the more situations, the more you're going to learn. Horses are very, very, very easy to get along with. If you just give them a second, remove all of your preconceived notions and ideas and listen. That is what the horse whispers, your natural horsemanship. That's all that is. It's listening. It's called listening and getting off yourself and that's humanity's greatest challenge right stormy <laughs> all right we're gonna cut this here and come back we did yes and there's your big close-up